Now also if we want to understand a little bit more about the values within the individual pixel, it's really quite easy to determine what's exactly what's within a pixel and all we need to do is go right click and this time we'll go to cursor location value. Now as, as we move the cursor around you'll see that the numbers will change within this cursor location value information box here. So first of all you'll see that the differences that there are changes in the location so the eastings and northings, latitude, longitude um, and also these values just at the top here which are um, letting you know whereabouts in the image you are also but based on a um, on a zero zero coordinate system of the corner as opposed to real map or that long coordinates. Now the most important information here I guess really is what the data is saying so as I move my cursor over I can see that those values there 306 etc um, are related or are the amount the temperature in degrees Kelvin received at the sensor. So subtract 273 from that um, and, you, and you get a rough indication of what the temperature is. Again there's no correction for the atmosphere so it's not entirely correct. But if we move over our really bright feature here you can perhaps get an indication of what the temperature is there also. If I was to do the same thing in my multiband image you'll see values for red, green and blue okay because we've got three bands displayed here they're the pixel values for those for each of those bands at the location of the exact crosshair of the pixel compared to just the single number here